Good morning, it is Hannah from Communication Wise and today I'm going to keep it really light. It's not about conflict and I'm going to be really short because it's not that deep, it's really light. So this is about where I wasn't practicing real wise communication the other day, which is good to mention because you know we can always improve and be aware of you know what we're doing that didn't work so well so i was at this party last sunday and um it was really nice because we don't have many parties these days because of corona and it was at a park kids and adults and so the host introduced me to a couple of ladies that you know i didn't know so there were american and non-americans and um, this one girl who was an american girl she was very very nice she asked me where i was from and then she said you know you must have not seen your family much you know being here and then being there and corona and everything and you know all these restrictions and i said that's right because this summer is going to be two years so she said wow like that must be hard and and she was just being really nice and empathetic and i jumped on it and i said well you know yeah because um i'm sad because i can't see my grandmother she's older and and you know from this to that to this to that and then i started feeling guilty because I do want my children to have a relationship with their cousins and they can't see their cousins right now. And before I knew, I was going down this path of feeling really, you know, sad and guilty and all those like things. And I was going on and at some point, like mid sentence, I stopped myself and I said, isn't this a beautiful day because it was a beautiful day because we um, were at this park the sun was shining and the kids were playing and there was a playground and a basketball court and everyone was having fun and so i became back to i i just came back to to the present of feeling that sun on my skin hearing other people you know having conversations and laughing and you know kids running around and just being outside being at that park being at a party and so i'm telling you this because it's so easy to go where we don't want to go especially when we're in a conversation with a nice person you know because you're not that uh, cautious because you, this was a really nice girl so from her just being nice i went from feeling great to not feeling so well because I started going down that path of everything that I didn't have. But by becoming, by coming back to the present of what I do enjoy, which was being there and, you know, and, and experiencing all those things instead of focusing what I don't have because of Corona and everything, I really just started making myself feel you know sad and angry or whatever guilty those things and i don't want to go there so i'm saying this because i was able to stop myself just come back and enjoy you know the party where we were the nice people the sunshine everything and um and i'm saying this and i know it's light and i know it is it doesn't seem so important but it is because it is very subtle you can go from here where you're feeling great to going down there because there's somebody who is being nice and ask you about what you don't have and and that's the moment to be extremely aware of no no we're not going there we're staying here where everything is sunshine and happiness and that thing that we don't have, well, you know, I don't wanna go there. I don't need to talk about it. And if I go there, I'll go there by myself and I don't go there because somebody else is asking me to, to go there. So be aware, be um, mindful of what you are saying just because you think it is a social acceptable or a social, you know, wishful answer. We don't have to go there we can just stay here where we're happy and keep it general keep it fun keep it nice so that's my light and 
you know a subtle message for today which is for me really really helpful and then i'm hoping um, this is helpful for you as well and if you would like like to let me know uh, what you think i'd be really grateful have a wonderful day